Hey guys, you're watching one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Build a Cruise Ship. Last episode was so much fun. We ended up making a V14 engine here. It's so cool. I absolutely love it. But you guys correctly sort of pointed out and said, AJ, one engine just isn't enough. You need more than one engine. Two side by side would be better. And I tend to agree with you. I think that would look better if we had two of them. I've got some more ideas as well with water pumps and stuff that we work in. I just want another sort of redstone messing about day, experimenting day. So let's go up, grab this corner. We should be able to just cut and paste twice and get two of them. So we've got that corner and then we want to come down. We want to make sure we grab all of this stuff. And we want to come down enough to grab all of the redstone at the bottom. I think you can cut and paste redstone. I've never done it, I don't think. And let's stand in the middle of the engine and cut it. Right in the middle. Cut. Oop. Well, it worked. We've got rid of the engine. And then if I come over here, and let's go from here. One, two, three, four, five, six blocks. Seven, eight blocks away from the edge. And then paste. Minus eight. That's loud. Turn my volume down a little bit. <laughs> Can I flick it? Okay, something didn't... 100% copy over. <laughs> oh, oh no. If I click it again. No. Oh no, what? Why isn't it stopping? Why wouldn't you stop for me? You should be stopping. <laughs> okay. Ah, it didn't bring one of the pistons over. How strange is that? That piston didn't come over with it. So now if I put these in here. Yeah. Huh. So it... Yeah, it just didn't bring over one of the pistons. That's strange. Anyway, we can now get rid of these eight blocks and do from the other side eight blocks. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Paste again. And we get the second engine. Again, this will be running. I apologize for the noise. These things are extremely loud. And... Yeah, that piston isn't there. I wonder why it didn't do that. There we go. That slowed the engine down and then we should be able to turn it off. One. <laughs> but, shut up. Shut up. Thank you. Okay, so we've now got two engines in here. That's so awesome. That's really, really cool. We are going to have to think about more lighting, though, because we're sort of removing this glowstone as we go, and it's getting dark again. So let's uh, cover up the... F well, let's make this glowstone for now, I suppose. Replace air with glowstone, just to give us light for this episode, and then I'll figure out off-camera how to do it any other way. So, what I want to have, though, in the middle are some water pumps. Obviously, water will deliberately be filled in the bottom of the boat to, for buoyancy and stabilization, but we want a way to regulate that. So, we're going to want to have some water pumps, and I'd really like this to go up to the roof and have, like, a piston that, like, and then water drops down for a time and then it blocks it back up and the water disappears so we get like some water movement and stuff and we also need a lot of pipes uh, from the pictures of googling uh, cruise ship engine room there's also there's always yellow pipes everywhere so we can do that with the yellow clay it's perfect block for it let's grab some glass I think would normal glass blocks how we've modified them look this you can hardly see them at all no, I think um, maybe white stained glass would be better then, so we can actually see them. We want to be able to see this glass, and we want to have that there. That's one block away from the edge. I want to make this symmetrical. One block away from the edge. And then we can get another one in the middle. Beautiful. So, we want these going all the way up to the top. Let me get rid of these lights. These aren't doing anything anyway. I've done them as a test, but there's just it's too far away to do anything. And then we want to have, I think, this block at the top. But we don't want it to be just the size of the pole. We want it to be a little bit bigger. So I'm going to add those. 
and then these around the edge. Then grab these slabs to cover up the bottom. Like this. And then we want a piston to block it up. It doesn't need to be a sticky one. Just a normal piston would be even better. Piston goes there. Oh. Oh, I haven't done it. <laughs> I haven't done it in the middle. No. Uh, let's move this back by one. Well, that's that's me being a little bit silly. I think I'm tired. It must be. That's the excuse that I'm going to put it down to. We'll have that one. And these. Now it's in the middle. And then we can have a piston like that. We can have the water up there. And then when the piston is extended, the water won't be able to come through. But when the piston is retracted to how it is now, the water will be able to flow. So we'll put these pipes up here. I'm leaving one gap because we don't want to be able to see the piston if possible. Uh, in fact, if I used, no, I can't use dispensers because they will be textured now, aren't they, to look like my, my cookers. Okay, I'll have to use a different block. What block looks somewhat like a piston? Does bedrock look somewhat like a piston? I think it's probably the closest we're going to have to look like the piston block, just so it sort of blends in to each other. That looks pretty good. I'm happy with that. Let's put glass on these corners. And on the bottoms as well. Let's have them on this level. Take out these ones. Replace them with these ones. And then the water can go into there. I can put like a little black. I think it would be better with a, a black inside. And then it looks like it goes deeper than it actually does. It looks like it actually goes somewhere. So we'll put those in like that. Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Yeah. So that water should be able to travel down into there. And we should be able to pump it quite easily. First, the redstone goes. I was thinking about hiding up the redstone inside these yellow clay beams. So if the piston is there, we should be able to power it with a redstone line going along here. Redstone. We don't want red dye. And a torch just to power it for the moment. There we go, so now the piston's extended, and uh, the red stone line can be hidden in between, oops, in between this uh, pipe that will run along the roof and, and run around. So we want this to go to that one, we want it to do this one, and that's, I tell you what, let me get all three pipes done, and then we can hook them up, okay? We don't want to do, uh, do the same thing for the whole episode, so let me uh, get cracking. All right, so I've got three identical um, water pumps in here, and we need to extend this redstone as we go. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to reach all the way in. How come that's... Oh, that one there. And one, two, three, four here. And I think it would be good if these went to just above the engine and then ran down that way. Uh, so let's extend this by another... Four blocks. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Well, if I just do the bottom first, I can put the redstone on, can't I? So it runs all the way down here. And then we haven't got the room for it to go down here. So I think we should have it coming this way. And then it goes down this wall. So we can have it coming down here. Like this. And we should be able to be able to turn this on and off with a lever over here. So if I put a lever on there, I can then have... No, I'd need a lever like that. Have a lever there with the torch on top. Then it looks like the pipe bends away and goes through this wall. We can have a torch, a block, a torch, a block. Oops, not that one. A block, a torch, a block, a torch. Take those out, and then a block, and then redstone, all the way down around here. We should probably put a repeater in so it can reach all the way. Repeater. Stupid beacons are in the way. I wish I never put those on. Whoops. Whoops. Should never put the beacons on. That one, 
and that will reach to there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That probably isn't going to reach. We'll do that. If we time them all at different times, that might even be better. So we'll have that one and coming down to there. If I put that one on a maximum delay, that one on a maximum delay, and then each one will move four ticks after each other. So if I flick this lever, they should now be closed, right? Yep, closed, closed, and closed. Perfect. But that will just open it up. That'll just open up the valves and or, or close the valves. We want them to open and close, so we need to have a hopper timer. Luckily, we've got a load of room up here in order to do it. And let me just double check that I'm going to build this right, so I don't have the same mistake as last time. Hopper, hopper, comparator. Yeah, block, pistons, got you. So, let's have ourselves a... I don't think we need sticky pistons, do we? That's got to go in here. This is where the hopper clock should start then. We should have a little platform to be able to build on. We're going to want to have the corner here, because that's what's going to be powering it. We don't need that on that side then. Then we want to have the redstone there. Is redstone on the side of the hoppers? I can't believe that I'm messing this up so bad. Okay, it's because it's at a different. Uh, I'm doing it at a different angle as well. Uh, we need comparator. I've got it now. I think I, I think I've worked it out. Comparator, there. Comparator, there. Get rid of these stupid beacons. And then a block there. Redstone goes here. Then we have hoppers going into each other. We have to place a block down first. Hopper there. Hopper. Ooh, can I shift click? Shift clicked. Got it. And then piston, piston, and redstone block. I don't think they need to be sticky pistons. And then if I put something in here. They do need to be sticky pistons. Interesting. And. Uh. Hello? Why you no push? Why doesn't it no push no block? There we go. Okay, we just had a, a little bit of a glitch going on. Okay, so we want to grab that. We're going to want to have more. Oops. Come back. We're going to want to have more than one item in there. Uh, we're going to want to have, I don't know, ten. Come here. Ten sounds like a, a more better number. We want it to be a slow one. We don't want it to be as fast as the engine. We want it to be a little bit slower. And then we can have the pipe can then come off here with the redstone on it, which will then control that. We can now cover up this and make it look like the actual pipe now. This is such a cool idea. And along the bottom. Yeah, you guys are like, you got to, you got to have water pipes. You got to have water pumps. You're right, you always come up with the best ideas. I wish <laughs> I wish I could come up with them myself sometimes. We'll have these along the back. And then we can just make this pipe bigger along there. This has to come down the wall pipe. Like that. And along the front. Are we still good? So it's closed. Oh, beautiful water. Let's get the water in here now. Uh, what's the best spot to go in for? There, probably. In that one. Ooh! Okay. Oh, I got rid of the lava. I got rid of the lever. No! We've got noise again. <laughs> that one? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, that one. Swap those around. And that one. <laughs> and that one. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, they're all on different times. Now, are they timed differently enough? I don't quite think so. I think another 
like four ticks of delay between each one would be perfect. So let's put in four ticks on that one. Four ticks on that one. They're not next to each other, but that shouldn't really matter. And four ticks on this one. And then there's eight ticks now between each one. So we should really be able to see a noticeable difference. There we go. That's so cool. Brilliant. We can also hook up both engines to each other to one lever. Uh, I think that probably makes sense now. We can have uh, control on the back wall here. Uh, probably a desk would be better. Um, mossy. Nice or iron. Yeah, iron blocks and this one and this one. And then we'll have an iron base. We'll bring it sort of out a little bit like that. Look more of a control panel look. Uh, we're then going to want to have a switchboard with levers and redstone torches on them. These will mostly be for decoration only. But I can have three levers and three torches. Uh, if I put them on top, they'll actually be controlled by these levers. Yeah, there we go. And which one? This one will be... No, we'll have... We'll make it easy for ourselves. We'll have this bottom one. Let's have a torch there. We'll have this bottom one have a lever. That will be the engine start one. So let's put it on an actual special block uh, like the chiseled. Chiseled one, not the monster egg one. Like that. It stands out a little bit then, doesn't it? And then we can have... Uh, 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 like this. Have the redstone start there drop down underneath the world hooked up to that one they're going to be going for a little bit sorry and straight over to this side i should be able to remove this one now that'll get that moving uh, redstone and repeaters quickly because they're so loud that one yeah. I'm going to put a repeater in on each way just so I know 100% that they're going to reach. And that goes in there. And that goes in there. And then I should be able to get up. I don't like this glowstone floor. We're going to have to do something about that. So the engines are going. And then flick the lever. And the engines stop. Beautiful. So we've got an on and off. For those, I think we need to get the monitors that we've done in the control room to get um, TV screens in here around this desk. We're probably going to need some seats, stairs. Some nice white ones would be good. To monitor it all, we'll have two of them on there. And uh, I don't know what else we really need. I mean, some more pipes going around the place. Maybe some different colored pipes. We've got yellow ones. Why not have... Um, red pipes that go up as well maybe on the other side that don't do anything they're just dud so we can have red pipes coming out here maybe they join up to the same part on the wall but the yellow one is the one that has the control so that would be right there and right there okay let me put some pipes down and I shall be back Okay, I'm just dressing up the area now and uh, I've changed the walls out to be a slightly grayer block. I think that looks much better. I've got the roof instead of planks being the stone to match the floor. Just more of an engine room vibe. Uh, I've put glow uh, or put the beacon sorry, around the edges here to give us enough lighting around the edges. The middle though is still dark so we need to find a way to sort that out and I think we're going to use these beacons but we're going to make a sort of pathway block that goes through maybe andesite I want like a metal block I wonder if there's anything special that we can use from one of the mods like these wouldn't be bad the scaffolding ones steel material four five two what happens if I done it with world edit would it mess everything up would it probably if we done a test from there to there, 
Four five two, wasn't it? Set four five two. It Oh it did do it. Is that the bottom of it? I don't know. That would be pretty good to have though. Why? Oh, can we just not see a part of it? It, it worked the other day. Oh, it's got to be off the floor. <sighs> if it's on the floor, it doesn't work. Hmm. That sort of works in a way. That sort of works in a way. Okay, if I went from here to there, I want them wrapped around the corner, really. Can I do it? Can it will they wrap around the corner? No. Hmm, no, they're not going to work either. Undo. Where's undo? No, they're not going to work either. That's a shame, because that, that had potential to work really, really well. Um, I don't know what else that we could we could try then. I want... You guys know what I want these. Mirror blocks. Really? It's me! <laughs> That is so weird. It's not f smooth, that's for sure. I've never seen that in Minecraft before. What? You're joking me. That is so cool. We should do all of our bathrooms like that. I've always wanted a mirror in Minecraft. Even sounds like mirror breaking. Oh well, I'm I'm happy now. I don't even I don't even care what we do for the rest. Straight pipe. For an engine room, yeah. Do they join up together? No, but we do have. I saw bent pipe was there as well. That is. So so cool. Okay, so we can have some of these about the place. Uh, in fact, I could probably do it easier for myself. And, ooh. Did I do that? Copy. And then I can just paste these around where we want. Oops. Paste. 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 Uh, on the back wall, it's not going to be quite as easy. But, oh, yeah. Maybe we don't have them on the back wall. Uh, and then... Paste. 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 And paste. Oh, that is so cool. What else do we have? <laughs> These ones are just frameworks. I'm not really that bothered about that. Light. I need. I need lighting. Lighting is now getting like d dreadfully important. There's all the train stuff. I don't think there's really anything else. I mean, the UAV station could work quite well as a control bit. How big is it? Okay, that's going down. That works. That works. I'm happy with that. We've got like a. You can actually fly planes using this. Fly remote control planes using the one of the plane mods I saw. Um. Okay, that's good. Lighting. We need to figure out lighting here. What if I had a strip of these glowstone lights in the floor? Like I had a strip going down here that went two blocks further. These are 208. Set 208. And I've done the same thing down here. Yeah. And then if we do it down this row. 
and down this row. That lever doesn't need to be there anymore. I think I've still got the lever on the other one, in fact. Like that. And then what if we changed up these blocks in the middle now to something like a nether brick? Uh, set 1112. Which is nether brick for us. There. 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 Like where you can walk. Go around the edge here. To there. We'll do a, a line of glowstone. Or, or, or the beacon, sorry. Down here. Uh, that one. To that one. And then back to the normal nether one. All the way down here. There's that lever that can now go. That one. To that one. That one. To there. Oops. That one. And that one. To here. Now we've got an engine room. That was so important to do. Okay, I'm happy. We've got pipes. We've got like air pipes and water pipes. They're all pumping around. We can turn the engine on. Hide. Cover your ears, guys, because it's, it's always loud, isn't it? That's so cool. Chug, 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 chug. Yeah. Okay. Whoops. That's that's gonna do it for this episode. I'm I'm just ch pleased as chips with this engine room. Now the pipes look awesome. And uh, if you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode. We're going to have to find a use for mirrors too.